It is Britain's biggest high street music retailer, but HMV has plunged back into crisis and is now on the brink of becoming the first post-Christmas casualty on the country's beleaguered high street after extremely weak festive sales. In a statement it said, even an exceptionally well-run and much-loved business such as HMV cannot withstand the tsunami of challenges facing UK retailers over the last 12 months, on top of such a dramatic change in consumer behaviour in the entertainment market. And this is why. Shopping is moving online and for many of us it's easier. With a click of a button we can buy, stream or listen with little fuss. It's to be expected with all the increase in technology, meaning you've just got the music wherever you want it. I think there's a lot of old school that still like to have proper music to play. Well, I've been shopping here for since the 80s, and I've got a big collection. I'd probably shed a tear. His master's voice featuring Nipper the Dog has been at the heart of the British high street for almost 100 years. This legendary brand's already been saved once in 2013 and made a comeback, this year even growing its market share. Selling 31% of all physical music in the UK and 23% of all DVD and Blu-ray discs. But the market is expected to fall by another 17% next year and for HMV that's unsustainable. Add to that the pressures of low consumer confidence, high rent, combined with a lacklustre Christmas that have also put other high street names in danger. Who's on your watch and worry list? Well, some of the fashion retailers are undoubtedly there. Um, Bon Marche has issued a profits warning. Debenhams has, we know about the issues around facing, de facing Debenhams. So these retailers are particularly vulnerable. So what would your predictions be for 2019? As dire as 2018? I think 2019, particularly in the first quarter, will be worse than, than 2018. HMV has managed to weather the storm once. The question is whether it can again. Sejal Karia, ITV News.